in the heart of what once was the cherished Khoi territory, where the lands once kissed by the sun now bears the weight of changing time, stands the Three Waters Cliff Dam, a poignant reminder of a connection to the ancestral spirits that seems to slip away like water through cupped hands. The Khoi people, once revered as the keepers of this ethereal land, find themselves grappling with a sense of longing and hurt as the dam echoes the voices of a fading spiritual realm. As the sun now reluctantly dips below the horizon, casting hues of orange and pink upon the water's surface, they are no longer Khoi elders gathered at the dam's edge. The stories etched onto their faces have deepened into lines of limitation for the sacred knowledge passed on through ages seemingly dissipating like whispers in the wind. In the quiet moments of dusk, where the land used to whisper ancient secrets, the dam stands as a silent witness to the rituals that once reverberated across its waters. The reflections upon the tranquil surface once believed to be gateways to the realms of the ancestors now shimmer with a distant echo of a spiritual guidance that feels increasingly elusive. Where once vibrant garments adorned with symbols of the land were cast into the dam as offerings, now the only remnants of faded memories and a few withered stones, fragrant herbs and traditional drums once part of a symphony of reverence have fallen silent, replaced by the melancholic rustling of leaves. The moon, now a distant observer, witnessed no more hands dipping into the cool still waters. The subtle pulse of ancestral energy once felt with pure intentions has become a distant memory and the reflections of the water once clear are now distorted by the ripples of time. In times of celebration and challenge, the Khoi no longer seek solace and wisdom from the dam of re reflections. The spirits, believed to have dwelled within the depths, now seem like echoes of a time when the tribe felt connected, guided through the ebb and flow of life. The dam, framed by towering mountains, stands in a silent testimony to the changing relationship between the Khoi and the land they once revered. The spirits, once thought to reside in every ripple, every reflection, and every breath of wind, now feel like whispers carried away by a breeze that no longer caresses the water's surface.